In this video, we take a look at the best shaders for low-end PCs. The downloads can be found in the link in the description down below and in the pinned comments. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So starting off this video strong, we have the Slidger's basic shader right over here. Now let's go ahead and apply it over to Minecraft. And when you load into the shader, you'll notice that things will honestly look pretty good. And this is a shader that is not going to like lag your game or anything like that. So you're still able to notice that it looks like the vanilla Minecraft. Like it's not overly realistic to the point where like you can't even tell that it's Minecraft or anything like that. So that is every pretty good, but we still do get brighter lighting and a darker defined shadows which will definitely come in clutch significantly and if we go ahead and take a look at the water here's how it does look like it definitely does look pretty good and again you are still able to get all the benefits of shaders you're able to get better lighting and all that good stuff and everything looks way more brighter without needing like an incredibly high-end pc or anything like that but if we go ahead and set this bad boy to sunset right up here here's how it does look like it honestly does look pretty good we do have a diamond shaped sunset and this shader will definitely get the job done next up we have the potato shaders when you load into the potato shaders here is how things do look like so you'll notice that things honestly do look pretty good and i did just notice that we actually do have a slight motion blur effect which is honestly pretty cool so guys if you like motion blur on your shaders then you're gonna like this shader in particular because we actually do get motion blur whenever we like turn around and stuff like that but apart from that the lighting is basically made to be like the same like the vanilla minecraft it's an extremely lightweight shader so like legit the shaders in this video are made to work on basically any pc that can run minecraft um you know we're able to get pretty good render distance i mean take a look at that guys like i would not be able to get this type of render distance on like a high-end shader and for reference i'm using an rtx 2060 which is the very first rtx card that did come out and even then we still have a reflection of the sun on the water right over here so that is how you know that this shader is honestly pretty cool but let's go ahead and actually set this bad boy to sunset really fast and here is how the sunset looks like it honestly honestly looks incredibly beautiful take a look at that guys we have the sunset being reflected on the water right over here we get so many different shades like orange yellow all that good stuff and it actually still does look pretty good uh despite being like a shader made for lower end pcs you know it still does look pretty good so i'm definitely pretty happy about that next up we have the miniature shaders when you load into the miniature shaders here's how things do look like so you immediately notice that the water is made to have like this really reflective look to it which is honestly pretty cool you're able to see that the clouds are being reflected on it same thing with like the terrain and all that good stuff so that is going to add a element of realism to your world and in general the lighting is made to be significantly more saturated and brighter which is definitely a major benefit and over here we do have the sky it honestly does look pretty good and again we are actually able to get some pretty good render distance with this shader pack even though we have like one of the most outdated graphic cards at the moment an rtx 2060 guys like i said that is the very first rtx card that did come out so uh you know my pc is not really that capable of running incredibly high-end shaders but with this shader we still are able to get somewhat decent performance and we do get incredibly reflective water but let's go ahead and set this bad boy to sunset right over here so here's how the sunset looks like as you're able to tell the sunset is being reflected on the water and it honestly creates this really beautiful and awesome looking effect remember guys the downloads to all these shaders can be found in the link in the description down below and in the pinned comments please like comment subscribe see you later french fries